Hello, here we will see some coil out aptitude questions. I will share you the trick to solve those questions. So stay with me and listen to me. The question which I have asked in the last video is what is special there in 4 which is not in the numbers 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7 and 9. Answer to that is in 4 there are 4 alphabets. So only 4 has the number of alphabets equal to its value. You can't find in any other number. Next speciality is you can find a like triangle in 4. You can't find in any other numbers. That's the speciality of number 4. Coming to aptitude question, it's given that amount contributed by each student and the number of students are same number. It means that if you multiply two same numbers, that is A and A, it's 64. It means A square is 64. So, 64 is the square of what? 64 is the square of 8. It means the answer is 8 students in the class. As 64 is a small number, it's easy to tell its square root as 8. What about large numbers? We need to know the trick, right? Come, let's learn the tricks. First step split it. So 24 and 0, 1 is the last two digits. Compare 1 or 9 can be the unit digit. Next 24 is close to a square number 16 and 16 is the square of 4. Then multiply 4 and 5. 4 into the next succeeding digit which is 5. So 4 into 5 is 20. And compare this with uh, the remaining digit 24. And 24 is bigger number, so the unit digit of our square root is 9. Hence, 2401 square root is 49. After splitting, it's 12. And last two digit is 25. So, the unit digit of our square root is 5. Next 12 is close to the square number 9, and 9 is the square of so the square root of 12.25 is 3.5 it's a 5 digit number so by splitting 123 belongs to the remaining digits group and 21 is the last two digits check the unit digit so it can be the unit digits of 1 or the 9 square then 123 so it's uh, more than 100 so it means you should know the squares from 11 to 20 here so 123 is close to the square number 121 and 121 is the square of, of 11 and multiply 11 into 12 it's 120 132 and uh, compare this with 123 and 123 is smaller than 132 so you have to choose the smaller number it's one hence the square root of 
results, 3481 is going to be the product of two same numbers. To find the answer, find the square root of 3481. So to find the square root of 3481, first step split it into two groups. So the last two digits is one group and the remaining digits uh, another group. Now check the unit digit. It's one, so it can be the unit digit of square 1 or 9. Next check this 34 and 34 is close to the square number 25 and 25 is the square of uh, 5. So next take 5 and multiply with the succeeding digit, succeeding number. So 5 into 6 is 30 and compare this with uh, 34. 34 is greater than 30, so the bigger number is chosen as the unit digit. So unit digit of our square root is 9 and the square root of 3481 is 59. So there are 59 rows and 59 columns. Answer is number of rows 59. something from this video then please like share and subscribe thanks for watching